Hi and welcome to my channel. In this video I want to discuss another topic that affected some players and others did not even think about. The anxiety of joining a small group of 5 or 10 players to do content. For the people that haven't even thought about it, you start thinking what if you mess up, how will you be judged, what if you're not prepared and things similar to this. I personally had this when I started PvPing with exactly those thoughts. It's a very annoying feeling that can be hard to overcome, but it is possible. Now I realize that there is nothing to be afraid of. You are a player among thousands and even if you do something goofy or stupid, no one will even care, so why should you? In the other half, there are players that join group content without even checking what the encounter is about or joining experienced groups asking for experienced people and then throw a tantrum because they did not read the requirements. Of course, this doesn't apply to everyone that doesn't have anxiety, but fortunately in Guild Wars there are only a few that act like that and the community is very understanding. What I can tell you is that first of all, you do not have to do instance group content if you do not want to or you do not feel safe. But if you decide to step on those fears and join a group, looking for training groups or groups that do not ask for kill proofs, you'll be surprised at how many people offer to help if you just ask. Who knows, maybe you'll get new friends. If you're 100% sure that instanced group content is not for you, then you can earn a lot of money doing open world meta events. They're usually big map events that give very good rewards and require a lot of people to coordinate to finish the objective. You do not have to join the squad, just open the event timer, join the map 10-15 minutes earlier and then wait for someone to tag up. I recommend to do this in the afternoon or evening as that is where all the maps will be populated and people will do the metas 100%. Also if you're not sure that the event will start or you're in the correct map, you can open LFG, go to the respective map and see if there are squads that mention meta and then the name or just meta. After that, follow the commander tag and get your rewards. Lots of times I did open world events because I did not have enough time to run the full fractal run or full strikes clear and just checked what metas were up and joined the maps. Don't worry, you will not have to say a thing if you do not want to. I hope this helped you and remember, Guild Wars 2 is a pretty casual game and people are very nice. But just to be safe, avoid elitist groups posted on LFG to have a nice experience. After you develop an I don't care what others think attitude, feel free to join whatever you like. If you want to see more content like this, please let me know in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed the video, please click the like and subscribe buttons.